Hi guys, I'm Zia Maliki from Information Technology. Today I want to show you how you can create your own electronic signature that you can use to insert into documents. Let's say you need to sign a document. Well, for that, you need to print out the document, sign it in, and then scan it again. And then you can send it off. But that's a lot of work and waste of paper. And plus, you need to have a printer. But what if you don't have a printer? Today I'm gonna show you how you can create your own electronic signature. An electronic signature is just an image of your signature and nothing else. So it's purely an image of your signature. Let's jump onto our PC and I want to show you how you can do it. Here I am on my PC and I have opened up my Word document. And here I have a reference check document opened that I need to sign. As I scroll down in the document, here I see a place where it says signature. And I want to put my electronic signature in here. Now the obvious way is I can print out the document, sign it in, and then I can scan it again and then send it off. The downside for that would be it will lose its quality and also waste of paper and wastage of time as well. Once I get it back onto my computer. But instead I can insert my electronic signature in here and I won't lose any quality or time. So how do we do that? Well, first off, we are going to open our phone. It works on both Android or iPhone. And we are going to sign our signature. I'm using an Android phone and we are going to use the OneNote app to sign our signature. And then bring that to our PC. To get the app, let's open the Play Store. If you have an iPhone, click on App Store. And next, search for OneNote app. If you don't have the app on your phone, it will say install. But since I have already downloaded the Microsoft OneNote, I will click on open. This opens up the OneNote app. Now let's click on this plus sign to create a new page. Now I will name this notebook as signature. Now I want to write my signature right in here. And we are going to use this writing tool or the pen tool up here. This opens up the pen tool and I have a number of different options that I can choose from. Here I can choose the color of the pen and I will choose the black color for my signature. Now I will write my signature in here. There we go, and here is my signature, and it all looks good to me. And once I'm done, I will come back to my PC and open up the OneNote application on my computer. For that, let's go to the search box and search for OneNote. Now click on the best match for OneNote and open it up. And that will launch the OneNote application. And here I see my signature on my PC in digital forum with super high quality. I'm going to click in the bottom of my name and make a box around it. And in here I have different options that I can change the font color, I can change the font weight and do other changes that I wish. And once you are done making changes to your signature, right click on it and copy. Now let's right click under the signature and paste the signature that we just copy. Now this is a little bigger than I want it. I need to reduce it a little bit, so, so I'm going to click on the object and reduce it. So that looks very good to me. And there is this extra space that I need to get rid of. And there is my signature above my title. And the quality looks outstanding. Now let's go back to the OneNote app. Let's say I want to make an image file of my signature and want to use it in the future as well. 
Now I could leave it in OneNote and every time I need it I could come and copy and paste it in the place I want but I really want to make a standalone file of it and to have it on my computer so I can use it again and again in the future. For that I'm gonna copy my signature and then we are going to bring it over to Paint. To open Paint go to your start menu and type in Paint. You will see Paint appears as one of the best matches and just click on that. This opens up the Paint app and now we can paste our signature here. So just press Ctrl V to paste. This paste my signature into Paint program and now I am going to click on Crop to get rid of the extra space around my signature. This cuts down the canvas to just my signature and now I can go up to the top left corner and click on file and I can go to save as next that opens up the file picker windows for now I'm going to put it on my desktop and I'm going to call it my signature and after that click on the save button and the file has been saved on my desktop now let's get rid of this signature so we can bring in our signature which we just saved on our desktop for that click on the insert menu and then click on picture now let's go to the desktop and find the signature file we just saved and here i will choose my signature and then i will click on insert and now let's decrease the size of the signature. Now here is our signature. Let's get rid of the extra spaces. And that looks pretty good to me now. Alright, that was a quick example of how you can create your own electronic signature that you can use to sign documents or contracts on your computer. If this video helped you how you can create your own electronic signature then give this video a thumbs up and if you want to see future videos like this in the future hit that subscribe button that way you will get a notification whenever I upload new content. If there is any other topic that you want me to cover please write it in the comment box and I will try to make a video on that for you. And that's all I have for you today in this tutorial. Till next time, it's goodbye.